Awada, here we go again. We are back with some more Mystery Case Files, 13th Skull, Last Rites. We uh, solved the mystery, got all 13 skulls, and it turns out that uh, Phineas Crown's ghost, Israel, came up out the swamp and took out the, uh, what was it, Brunston's? The criminals. He killed the criminals. Apparently drowning them. So I guess there's, what, 16 skulls now? Anyway, maybe maybe they need time to ride or whatever. But um, let's see what this last rights thing is about. Do I just click play? All right. Uh, before I get started, if you like my videos, please don't hesitate to give them a thumbs up. And if you haven't done so already, click the subscribe button. I would greatly appreciate it. And I would love to see you here for my future videos and the ones that I've already done. Anyway, we wrote something. Let's uh, check it out. I presently stand dumbstruck before what appears to be a, excuse me, no fewer than a dozen uh, galleons towering above the cypress and willows surrounding the swamp's clearing. All right. Uh, just moments ago, I witnessed the otherworldly spirit of the pirate Phineas Crown step forth into the warm breeze and take take gruesome vengeance on my aggressive or I'm sorry on my aggressors uh, those guys even a little girl after it vanished <laughs> I searched frantically for a sign of the Blanstons but I fear they are forever lost in the dismal waters uh, no I didn't I was glad to see him go to be honest with you but anyway I don't know why I was spared, but I'm too awestruck to give it much thought. Although the idea of boarding these ships uh, opposes any rational sense completely, I can't help but feel there's more to this twisted tale. I'll rather I'll gather the skulls for safekeeping and then try to climb aboard. All right, so I guess I'm gonna three vicious alligators guard their nest. Okay, that's fine. I don't. I want the skulls. I was able to. I was able to get to the skulls before. Why can't I now? Oh, I already got them. Okay, cool. We're, I guess we're gonna try to get on this pirate ship. Looks like I'll. I could use a rope to climb up the side of the ship. Or a rock. Or another rock. Gotta throw these rocks at the rope. I have terrible aim. Very terrible aim. Got him. Alright. Beware the curse of Crown. Okay, investigate the pirate ship for clues regarding Crown's treasure. This hatch leads to the ship's hold, but it's rusted shut. Alright, let's move up the side here, see what we got. We got this wheel, let's look at the wheel. Looks like the ship's wheel is missing a few pieces. Hmm. I don't know what it looked like to begin with, but apparently not like that. So, we're going to search around here. We're looking for a pulley, a goblet, and a cannonball. There's a cannonball. Uh, a hand, which is right there. Here's a frog. A toadstool, which is a mushroom. A flask. Hmm. Uh, oh, that turned out to be a paper cup, but I needed it anyway. Good show, old chap. Uh, that's a thermos. Glass bottle. A key. Hmm. There's the glass bottle. We need a compass, propeller, and golf ball. There's the golf ball and the compass. Apparently I uh, clicked the compass trying to click the golf ball and found the compass in doing so. I'm not going to argue with it though. Now we just need that pesky <laughs> pesky propeller. Uh, I'd have thought that'd be easy to find. Apparently I'm wrong. We also need to find a key, a flask, goblet, and pulley. The swamp shall be ye home. Yo ho ho and a bottle of rum. 
Alright, um, that, whoop, there's the key. Now we just need a propeller, flask, and goblet. Hmm. Hey, frog, have you seen a goblet? So here with the Ada. Ada eating goblets. There's the flask. Uh. Is that the propeller? No, that's the goblet. Wow, I am like clicking things, thinking there's something else, and just finding everything. But I do need that propeller now. Looks like a big old pizza cutter. It's probably not, though. Um, that's an axe, that's a crutch. Rope saw, mask. Baseball. That's a dragonfly. It's a hat, a camera, a snorkel. I don't know. It looks like an eyeglass or a periscope or something like that. Top of one, anyway. A roll of paper. Was only the no, that wasn't the roll of But that was. Did he say Eugene? Eugene was only the beginning? Okay. So Eugene was only the beginning. Gonna, I can't climb past the broken mass, and it's too heavy to move. Okay. Oh, I need to find the parts of the uh, missing wheel, so look around here. I don't see any of those parts. Oh, it takes me to the same spot. Okay. Oh, look! A puzzle. Alright. Um. Okay. Uh, C-R-O-W-N? No. Uh, P H I N E A S. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. We're gonna go with Phineas. So that'll be S. A. E. S A E. N. I. H. P. Alright, so doing it, uh. Um. Where in the world is the P? A, B, C, D, E, F, E, H, I, L, M, N, O, R, S. Um. Okay. It's not Phineas. There's no P. Alright, I have no idea what it's supposed to say. That's really weird. I don't even remember the name of the ship. I don't, I don't even know if the ship had a name. I'm assuming all this. Oh, I can go back through the town and such. Okay, cool. Gonna talk to people. Find stuff, maybe. That dude's gone. I guess every dog should have. Uh, she's still stuck on the dogs and fleas thing. I don't remember seeing pieces of the ship wheel anywhere. 
and I don't reckon. Hey, Miss Cleo. <laughs> um, I don't reckon I need to be in here for anything. Still can't go in. Ah, oh, they left that dog here. I don't know why I'm searching around here. Ooh, that's why I'm searching around here. Because we're looking for a battery, a harmonica, roses. See, I know what I'm doing. We need a soda, that was over here. We need a shell, a fish bowl. Fish bowl's right there. Ice pick is there. Mouse. Oh, uh, the dreaded mouse. There's a pacifier, a moth, and a penny. There's a moth. Looking for a penny and a harmonica. There's the harmonica. A very interesting instrument. Um, you see, penny, mouse, the egg is over here broken. That's the frog. I don't know if I'll be able to find a mouse, y'all. Y'all help me find this mouse. Shell. I, I just clicked on an egg shell. I'm assuming you mean a seashell. Mm. Here's the penny. Battery. Now when I read that the first time, I was thinking of like a car battery, but I think it's this guy. Yeah, it's like a D battery. Uh, okay, mouse in a shell. That's a snail with a shell. Guess that's not counting. So good, too. Just gotta find that mouse in the shell. See this right here, y'all? This right here is the mouse. It's a computer mouse. <laughs> Not a shell. I have no idea what kind of shell I'm looking for. Mm. That's pizza, phone, there's a television, a hat. Wig, it looks like some honeysuckle, a belt. I don't even know what that is. It looks like a beaver. Oh, that's a ring. I guess that's the shell. <laughs> and we have an ice pick. Ooh, ooh, I bet you I can, yeah, I know what I need that for. Are y'all still not here? Oh, and the music started back. Um. I want my weight. So oh, those are just bones. Um, I wonder. What was I wondering? I forgot what I was wondering, y'all. Look, the ice picks for the uh, over here. This place, ice chest, ice pick. Ah. I have three of those now. Is that all that was for? Holy crap. All that was just for that? Okay. Um, okay. 
I need to get. I need to get on the boat or get in the door. Wait, what did that say? Like no hints or anything. I, I don't know what this is supposed to be. Is there something around here to tell me what it's supposed to be? The swamp shall be your home. Oh, I'm gonna keep on doing this. There we go. That's how that's how we roll, yo. That's how you use your brain. Wheel missing pegs. A rotting deck of the pirate vessel of the pirate's vessel makes moving about rather dicey. Centuries of submerged of submergence beneath the swamp's surface has left the ship's structure moldering and decaying. Mm -hmm. I have no idea how it remains intact in the distance. I can make out the withering skeletons of several other boats that comprise what I assume to be Captain Crown's ill-gained fleet. Repeatedly dropping a stray bowling or sorry cannonball easily uh, splintered the mossy floorboards, creating a modest hole that allows exploration below. The ship's hull groans loudly as the uh, decrepit uh, vessel rapidly takes on water from countless holes. Whatever I'm doing here, best be done quickly before this thing slides back under the swamp. A swath of wreckage is the hold prevents, and the hold prevents additional survey. Was only the beginning. Did you say a gene? There's a peg. Did you say a gene or Eugene? Some debris blocking my way. There's the other thing here. Oh, uh, this again. I don't know what I'm looking for now. Is that all I was looking for? It's not going to stop, is it? Mm. Alright, are you going to like stop letting me do this when I find all that I can find in here? Please tell me you will. If I leave this like this, will you stay this way? Alright, anyway. Let's go put this... Oh, oh, wait. We can look through here again. Now we're looking for a baseball, umbrella, and a camera. I'm going to put the camera being there. There's the umbrella. Baseball, lantern, I remember being up there. Aluminum can. A newt, which is a kind of lizard-looking thing, for those of you who do not know that guy. Uh, a goblet, which I thought was a propeller. Snorkel, which I remember looking at. A hornet, right there. A lure, which is up here. I remember looking at that. A rope coil, over there. Uh, a tricorn hat. Yeah, the hat. Uh, the aluminum cannon baseball is all I need now. And, uh, 
There's the aluminum can, and the baseball has eluded me. Nope, there it is, right beside the... Why did that flick about like that? That was weird. Alright, so now we're going to put the pegs on the... on the... Um, wheel. See what happens. Okay, we completed the objective. Let's turn the wheel. Continue investigating the pirate ships for clues regarding Crown's treasure. Can't continue to climb here. Can I try this rope? Can I try to rope here? Can I try to rope here? No. Alright. So. What did turning the, the what did turning the wheel do? Did it change something down here? It did. All right. If I shot the gun like this, I would lose the harpoon. Of course I would. So I put the rope on there. Let's look at this over here. We're looking for a molar, which is a tooth, the back tooth, um, a skull. And a sack. <clears throat> Which can look pretty much like anything. So, looking for a molar. A skull. There's a skull. A sack. An ace. A conch. Which is one of those big seashells that if you put to your ear, you can hear the ocean. Um... A saber, which is uh, a sword. There it is. A button, a crown, and a fish. I just saw a nice. Okay. Uh, a nanner, a chisel, and a pan flute, which is the uh, this thing has different length of pipes that you blow into. Alright, so now we're looking for button, crown, fish. I saw a fish. Here's a fish. Hmm. Crown and a sack. There's the tooth for a molar. Sack, sack, sack. Thought I would have found a crown by now, too. There it is. Nope. Oh, I thought that was a crown. I was all confident too. I was like, there it is. But I think that's it, yeah. And there's the button. Mm. Conch chisel. Banana. There's the banana. Still looking for a chisel and a sack. insist on giving me somebody yelling that I'm running out of time. And yet I can still take my time. Chisel, conch, and a sack. It's a whistle. that chisel? Yes. There's the conch. And now a sack. Okay, good. Good deal. What we got? That's the, uh, sword. Move to the neighbor ship. Alright, before we continue, I'm gonna back up here. Uh, I'm gonna call this one it. Before... Was only the beginning. I believe that's like the name that we need to open that door back on the first deck. But um, I'm gonna I'm gonna wrap this up right here. Next time we'll we'll go across and check out the neighboring ship. 
Uh, if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. And if you haven't done so already, click subscribe. I would love to see you from now on in these videos. Um, so I hope you join me next time. And until then, deuces, gooses.